That's Dabalicious, my dude. Yeah, yeah, what up? It's your boy Skinny Pete back here again with a Toker Waits Toker Thought. <coughs> I'm <coughs> dying on Dab here. I'm here with my boy. Yeah, the Enigma. My girl. The word. <coughs> my other girl. Sugar and Vanilla, Chris. <coughs> and I'm your host for tonight, the Hippie. <coughs> so, yes, we have Dabs. Yes, we finally <coughs> got a guy, or finally got a guy had life. <coughs> it's a very good thing, and I immediately snug that shit up. <coughs> got oh, some God. of that honey to freaking drop one on. <coughs> but today we have a list, a big list of random fucking things thought of throughout the weeks and throughout the days that we've <coughs> come up with and written in the great notebook, Tokerweight's Notebook. I legit sat down for an hour and wrote down random shit we were talking about. Oh, we have a new piece. Oh, yes, we have a new piece. Okay, oh, so God. this one, this we one. were going to call the lung buster, but somebody already coined that phrase with one of their pieces. Shout out to Custom Girl 420. We call it Bomb Dimidome. Like Doug Dimidome from the Fairly Odd Parents. Yeah, it's big ass. It hat. is like a 32 inch. Bong that we ripped a few dabs out of, and oh my god, we got a couple great. cherry bombs through it. It will fucking get you stoned. It, it'll rip, it'll rip your day up, but it's great. And another crazy thing going on is in the world of cherry bombs. If you guys don't know what a cherry bomb is, is when you roll a half blunt or a full blunt, and then you stick it in a bong bowl. And you pack weed around it, and you smoke the blood all the way down until it hits the bowl. And whoever gets to where the bowl is, and it makes the whole bowl and get you get this fat ass rip that fucking puts you on your ass. Your gums are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy, you know. <laughs> that's going to be vomiting on your sweater. <laughs> shit, you're right. There's a lot of shit going on right now. Finger Bro. knees, James. <laughs> Finger knees! So... They're not called knuckles anymore. They're called finger knees. Finger knees. Yes, finger knees. Like, you know, like, finger knee man. Well, I mean, like, you have two knuckles on what? each finger. No, 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 what? but what does the F have two chicks? <laughs> it's finger man. It's like finger knees. Uh. <laughs> uh. Uh. Yeah. Shark puppet, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Cheeks. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Slav squats. Jimmy Slav squats, bro. Apparently, I am a Slavic person because I like squatting a lot, and it's very comfortable for me to do it. Well, your dad was in Russia for an undetermined amount of time. For uh, at most two, like two or three years. While they were communists, still. Yes, while they were communists, when it was still the USSR. It was ridiculous. <laughs> This crazy shit, crazy. So yours, man, Russia, Republic. So yeah. But Insert. Elmo was it? Oh yeah, the Elmo, the Elmo meme where he's just looking up and it's just like the Russian missiles in the background. Just <laughs> put a fucking Russian general hat on him or some shit. I'm gonna insert that meme right now. Враг сзади по левому флангу! Хорошо, колбасы, веселее, пацаны! So we're gonna have fun with this. We're gonna be. I'm gonna do a little something different with these episodes. I'm actually gonna put content you can actually see on the board. All kinds of shit. What's with the thing with the free lighter? Yeah, what's free lighter? Bro? Oh, it was when I got. When I bought the water pipe, the lung buster, the lung collapser. Bong dimidome. They were like, you get a free lighter. And I was like, fuck yeah, free lighter. Ghost activity. So what's going on with that? Ghost activity. Some shit's been going down, apparently. Some shit. Crazy shit. Fucking light switches are being left on or turned on in the middle of the night. Cabinet door is being left open. It's been fucking with me. Yeah, so in our house, there was a room, the room that we're in right now was vacant. We were just using it for storage for the longest time. Wait, our cabinet's opening? Yeah. Man, that's fucking weird, crazy shit, dude. Did 
Dude, and it did that, that to me remember earlier. That one night, remember that one night where we heard something crash down in the kitchen but nothing was there? Yes. James and I heard something, like, it sounded like a cat jumped on the counter and tried to climb over the sink. And knocked the and knocked down. a cup and Tupperware down. It sounded like a cup was spiraling around yeah. and shit. Clear as day. James and I burst up. I'm fleeing out of the door. Like, what the fuck? Wait, this is the last I've night. Got a, a, no. no, no, this, this was is like a few months, months ago. ago. This, this, no, I, I actually like, I came out, I went out in the kitchen about one or two in the morning. I was like, I was just fucking thirsty. Fuck, while all the cabin was over, I was like, fuck this, is going bad. I went to bed, I did not fuck with that shit. Oh, well. But, and this happened just like three nights ago. I, I'm in here, I'm in the studio here, I'm, I'm shutting everything down, I'm about to go to bed, and I make sure I shut off the lights. Before uh, the warden and uh, the enigma went to bed, they were like, hey, be sure to shut off the lights. I'm like, yeah, I always shut off the lights. No, I always do, and I make sure I shut off the lights, because power's money. Money's power. <laughs> okay. But, and, was... hold up, and when I go to bed, I'm, everything's off. I wake up in the morning... They're like, oh, you left the light on last night. I'm like, no, I didn't. I shut it off. I made sure I did. It's strange. It's very strange. Poofle is getting locked in the bathroom. Oh, my God. Somehow she got locked in the bathroom. She had followed Avi into the bathroom before. So it's there's no telling when she had went in there because she could just snuck in there behind someone's feet. Yeah. And Jimmy's prone to leave the door open longer than he needs to. Yeah. <laughs> but, regardless of that, nobody recalls seeing her or, like, like, we saw her, and then all of a sudden, she was locked in the bathroom. Like, dude. Like, how the fuck did she get in the bathroom? I swear it's a ghost. Okay, a new conspiracy is coming up. We gotta do an episode about this. How is the Rarugaru related to Dongfoot? Oh my god, okay. Um, no, no, we're gonna talk about this later. This uh, is an upcoming conspiracy one on. we gotta talk uh, about. Um, I interrupt Yes cast to bring you another rip of death. Oh, nice fail. <laughs> Yes, but we're going to talk about the Aruguru, Sasquatch, the Yeti, how they're related, who's the aunts, who's the uncles, how, what's their personality, let's figure out we can figure these Yetis and uh, Bigfoots out. Let's figure out the do, family do, tree uh, of Bigfoots. Do a big Dongfoot update episode? Bro, yes. Another Dongfoot episode, great. So, coyotes. Coyotes? <laughs> Fucking coyotes. Like, what what, what, the, what inspired that, buddy? Oh, it was when we were in the tent doing that freezing ass tent cast. And we heard something outside and we were like, it's coyotes. <coughs> oh, God, yeah. It was coyotes. <coughs> All the unexciting. Ding! Oh, my God. The freaking. Oh, my. The message. That so, shit was. Uh, it was like yeah. ear piercing. Even when I turned it down in the recording, it was still ear piercing. What about my fart? Kind of, which, one, which one was that in? I don't remember, <laughs> but I... Oh, as a note, if you fart on air, it will be amplified. <coughs> yes. Like 30 times. Because fart jokes are still <laughs> funny no matter how old you get. Exactly. Can so, how, how high can we possibly get? How, okay, how high can you get... Well, you can become green out where you vomit. <laughs> I've only ever gotten to that like once in my life. That was bad. I've been there twice. And that was the first time I took it down. And it was the night I had like a quarter pan of weed brownies. Very, very strong weed brownies. Dude, I made. Yeah, Jimmy's. Jimmy's brownies are. The Rougarou. Fucking bullshit. So, quick thoughts and a theory you want to throw at me, James. Alright, uh, Denver Airport. Denver Airport, okay. Do you really think it's Illuminati's headquarters? Not the headquarters. Probably, probably Doomsday Bunker, yes. 
I would <coughs> say so too. What do you think? Where do you think the Illuminati's headquarters is at? Oh, pro- probably somewhere out in the middle of the ocean. They're probably on their own island. That's an undocumented island. Do you know what I say? What? DC. Yeah, I believe that probably the underground in DC. Smithsonian. Does it really only hold all the archives? Yes. But I would say Iron Mountain is one of them. True. True. Iron Mountain is impenetrable, pretty much. And you have to have, like, very high security access in order to get, like, into the mountain. But anyways, guys. We need to talk about more conspiracy theories. <coughs> yes, we got to do more uh, conspiracy thoughts, or whatever we call all them. I love conspiracies. I listen to them all the time. Please, leave a comment and give us ideas about conspiracy theories. Let us know which ones you like and which ones that you want us to research and talk about. Um, but... Also, click the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Definitely leave that comment. Hit the bell notification so you know that every time we upload something and we get really high and talk about shit, you can get really high too and talk about shit with us. But we don't do this live every now and then. <laughs> Follow us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash Tuberweights, Instagram.com at the Tuberweights, and on Twitter at the Tuberweights. I've been the hippie. Uh, I've been the enigma. I've been the warden. Ebony Empress. And we've got a lot of ideas to talk about. We hope you do too. Leave that comment. Good night, everybody. Tough rights off the air. Yeah, yeah.